Hey everybody and welcome back. My name is Sue and I'm from OML Embroidery and today is embroidery mail time. Embroidery mail, yay! Yay! So can everyone see clearly and of course can you hear us? Uh, we had a glitch when it started out so we just want to double check and then we're going to get into it. Let's play your live so we can see. Well you can't whisper it, they can hear you. They can't hear me. Yes, they can. Yay for embroidery mail. All right, so Judy Qu Quilt can hear me. I've been staring at this just waiting for the clock to come down because, ooh, look at this, look at this quilt. This month's mix of charming and rustic designs will have you fallen for fall. Ooh, it looks cute. Yes, we can, Dawn. You can't whisper. Oh, you have, to, you have to press play because whatever. Silly. All right, so let's get into it. You ready for this? Yep, let's go. Because it looks like there's some really good stuff. Oh, Olanita had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. <laughs> I love it. This guy's cute. This. Ooh, cutesy cozies. Should be a nice view. I'm glad we don't have to. I might need one of those. I'm glad we don't have to worry about reflections anymore. This yeah, is much nice. nicer. No glare. Release radar. Ooh. That is so cute. Almost autumn. Not yet. We still have another hot month. It's getting close. <coughs> I guess. I can't believe it's August already. Pocket notebook covers. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. Chrysalis applique. Buttery flies. Oh, I like the Beautiful. simplicity quilt. Oh, yeah. I look at that. that. That is really pretty. Mm -hmm. You guys can see. Yep, yeah, they can see my mouse. Um, Look at the colors. The turquoise and the pink. They look cute. Yep, we're going to get into it a little bit more. What the heck? I love it. Pet bag dispensers. Poop bags. Oh, they're awful cute. We're going to need to make some of those too, aren't we? Yep. Um, look at this guy, though. That yeah. is the coolest pizza I have ever seen. Cutesy cozies. Yep, uh, I'm into I that. Yeah, we'll have to see what they have for a selection. Um, I need a good design online, so there's smaller collections. Um... 20 embroidery designs, including 20 main quilt blocks, 14 detail blocks, borders, and sashing. That's so, awesome. Yeah, what catches my attention, there's two things, is the sunflowers, because those are phenomenal for a sashing. And I love it when designs go outside the box, literally. I think that's really cool, like the horses' oh, hooves yeah, are outside. I like, I like how the windmill's out. Yeah, and the chicken feet, and I for Cindy King, I forgot your 1 o'clock is my 2 o'clock. Well, I wanted to eat a little bit and have a drink um, so uh, we can get back into it. So, Oh, Roanoke, hello. Hi again from the north of Norway. Feels like we just left you. We kind of did. Cow is cute. Rooster is cute. Well, we're going to look at it in bigger pictures. <laughs> Hi, Dawn. Sorry I didn't hear you earlier. That's okay. Hello. We like it that way. I'm just way. quiet in the background. No, Dawn's never quiet. Old Anita had a farm. Well, it's not old, but old. Ah, uh, quilt blocks. Critters galore. Oh, look at this with oh, the, the corn, corn in the nice front. Outside, yeah. Wow. Oh, a corn border. The Stroms would love that. Denim Delight. I love using denim, too. Detail blocks, borders, and sashing. Yep, I love it. I love it. Embroidery designs. Okay, I, I love like the it. tractor. That's pretty cool. Uh, I think all of it is cool. Mm -hmm. Fabulous fabric. Ah, oh, if you want to do it the way they have it, look, it tells you what you need. We used Floriani <coughs> polyester embroidery threads. Yep. Double duty, backside, front side, and all the colors. Cool. Very nice. Cool. 
um, some new people here. Thanks to all our mods. I forgot to thank you in our first live today. So thank you. And thank you everyone for being here. Oh, look at that. That is gorgeous. Quilt inspiration. All right. So these are all close up critters. I love them. Duck, duck, denim. <laughs> That's awesome. That's pretty good. Duck, duck, denim. To make the most of our folded fabric borders, we opted for a max maximum visual contrast. We use both the front and back side of the denim to get two colors from one fabric. That's what they were talking about in the Same. page before. Duck, duck, pig. It looks really good. Duck. Duck, pig. Duck. Oh, see, this is pretty too. Rustic tartan. That looks gorgeous. I like it. Fab idea. Yeah, Fab it's a, idea. It's a different look. It's pretty cool. I really like it, actually. <clears throat> Tartan and then a striped. Who'd ever thought you could put those together, but you can. All right, there's my sunflowers on the outside for the sashing with the denim. Yep, I like that. Yeah, country, old country kind of feel. Fantastic ideas. Oh, then they mixed them both. Cool. Look at the corn and the sunflowers. That's, I am yeah, so in love. It's nicely put together. And groups of four. Oh, man. That's fun. There's my favorite one. I'm going to declare already that this one with the old barn and the corn in the front is my favorite one. So awesome. Sunflowers for me, says Ju Julie. Sorry. All right. Then you get your design size. So... I usually end up doing the 8x8. Eight eight. Um, I'm pretty happy with that. So I usually do the... Oh, that's 8x12. Hmm. 7x11, 6x10, and 5x7. All right. I'll have to figure out... Um, ah, don't touch me. You scared me. Don. I didn't do it. Anatomy of the design. And this is where they show you how to put everything together. Oh, is Karina here? Hello. Sorry I'm late was doing some embroidery. Well, that's a perfect excuse. So detail blocks. This is how to do them. And we go through this a lot. So square out your uh, batting and then trim it and then um, put your fabric over. They happen to be using white on this one. And then all your appliques going on first. And I love this little bit of fabric and a lot of embroidery design it just um really gives it a good look and then of course the folded fabric oh they played chicken a little bit here can you see that don yeah a little bit little crooked bit. that's a sue move but they made it they made it and that's with jean i really like that so you trim it and then you put the left and right sides on Detail block designs. Okay, now we can see it clearly. That duck is pretty serious looking, and he's really cute. I like it. Moo. Moo. Oink. Just moo. I don't know what noise um, a rabbit makes, but... <laughs> They're just cute. They don't They're really just make cute. Noise. Stunning roosters and chickens, and the horse looks like he's running free. That's very nice. Um... I really like them. Donkey! Oh, and of course, the dog and the cat, because there's always a farm, farm dog and a farm cat. So I like that inclusion. Farm kitty. Look at how beautiful this is. His best friend's farm pig. Farm pig. Don. <laughs> I can make faces at Don, and you guys can't see it, so... So these are the main blocks, and this is how to do them. And it's, you know what, it's basically the same. Um, the sashing, the squaring, just different designs. Oh, I like how this one comes together. So applique, of course. And what's really handy is that this part here, the cow, is applique, so it's um, over. You don't have to worry about the stitches showing through. It's I love neat it. how they bring it outside the framework. I think that is just a wonderful <clears throat> touch. Looks like Wilbur from Charlotte's Web. Yeah, I think that's Don. What Don was um, thinking of. 
I love that Friesen cow. My husband was a farmer and I had a herd of Friesen. I, 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 it's cute. It's I a, love <laughs> It's a cow to me. I don't, it's I don't a know the differences. I was trying to find <laughs> the words for that, but uh, it's beautiful. It's mm -hmm. a wonderful embroidery design. So, oh, look at that. That's so cute. Okay, that is beautiful. You know, having them outside of the blocks there gives it like motion. Moo. Sarah says moo. <laughs> Thank you. Oink. I like it. They all look happy too. Happy farm animals. Nice These details. On yeah, that. I know. Look at this guy. Beautiful with those big old feathers hanging over. That house looks uh, house a horse. Looks like he's just galloping free. Um I like the ducks, yeah, so do I. I actually I like them all. Oh look at Dougie. He's awful cute. And Donkey. Wow. Oh, I like the yellow flowers. Very nice. Awesome. Oh, Anita had a farm. Oh, oh, farm house. Farm cat. It looks like he's crawling. Oh, with a bird. I hope he's not chasing the bird, but no, that's I like what they the do. Tractor. Tractors. Old tractor. That's awesome. And I like the house with this detail in the background. The field sounds neat. And the tree is actually gorgeous. Hmm. Oh, this is going to be so much fun. And the hay bale coming out. Oh, man. So I am going to do these um, barn ones. This is my favorite right here. I'm going to make that as big as I can. That is stunning. It looks like a painting kind of thing borders and sashing so this is the part i like about anita good design they are thorough with telling you how to do it then you know creativity remember you can change everything you can do mix and match um you can look they give you ideas to set everything out I think the corn I and like the that. sunflowers look really good together like that i think it's really cool are you off for a moment don Don will be right back, which is cool. All right, yeah. See, sunflowers and corn. I think it's because it's the yellow thing going on. I think the corn is beautiful, actually. And the sunflowers, so much detail in such a small design. So it's going to be fun to put this together in different ways with different colors like the red on the outside of this one is stunning i love it um this is the other nice thing did dawn go get candy no not yet we haven't had time is that linen fabric it looks like it yes so this is what i like because i'm still learning sewing i'm getting better at it i have something i will have something to show you guys later um, but they show you how to match everything and what order to do it because that's really important. And if you look, you can see what foot they're using, the whole bit. Ironing, I know we joke about me not iron, ironing, but I do all the time. So, yeah. So this is good, how to put it together, how to stitch it together, and the order that you do it. Uh, I love it. I love it. There we go. And the backing. Oh, isn't that pretty? Okay, so I like the red. I never would have thought of red. Oh, this is how you make your um, outer bias tape, I guess they're doing. Yep, and they show you exactly how to match it, how to put it together. This is the part that I have difficulties with. I have not mastered it yet, especially this connection part, but I'm working on it. So this I find super helpful um, that I have the instructions right in front of me. I think that's really nice and how to fold it and the all important miter edge and sewing it. So man, I love it. So far so good. Well, look at that. For all of you, you cow lovers there, that looks amazing. And so does this with the, you know, frames like that. That looks great. Um, 
candy cane. Yeah, that's funny, you guys. So piggy, I like the piggy. And embroidery step-by-step -step to show you how to do the applique. So that's awesome. So these are just embroidery designs, not quilt squares. You're back? I'm back. All good? All good. I wanted to show you this done. Look at on the back of a jacket. Oh, that's neat. Isn't that it neat? It looks good on the denim, too. Yeah, yeah, I know. And I was just saying, these with this, like, antique distressed frame. The barn is so beautiful. I know. It's amazing. And then we're going through the embroidery designs, which are, they're not quilt blocks. They're just embroidery designs. I'm sure they're all in different um, sizes. But see, this is adorable right like that. And the rooster and all these guys, the puppy running. Yeah, they're nice standalone designs yep. without the framework. Yep. I kind of like it. I still love the tractor and I like the windmill. This is still my favorite. Although I think this looks better as a, a quilt block, but mm -hmm. I didn't notice there was clouds in the background. Yeah, you know what? You could make like a, a triptych. So three of them. Put this barn in the middle, then there, then there. I think that would be stunning. Ooh, almost autumn. It's time to fall in love. Festively fall. Fabrics. I love reading all this. I've already copied it to my iPad, so I'm going to sit. Um, I'm going to sit and watch. It's very nice with the digital to be able to do that. Well, yeah, I'm going to sit and read everything. Mm -hmm. So on the jacket, was it embroidery only or applique? Pretty sure the cow was applique, which is nice, which is really nice. Welcome fall. So here are the design sizes for this. 8 by 12, 7 by 11, 6 by 10. So they're bigger designs. Oh. Oh, the hoodie owl. Oh, is he ever I cute? It. I love it. That fabric is awesome as well. Okay, hoodie owl with skinny eyes, but darn cute. So a little bit of applique. I love how he's pieced together out of different leaves and things. Yeah, that's, neat. that's really neat. So making a placemat, everything you need um, for it. I love it. I like this gather. Oh, and of course, all these parts that I can't do got more instructions specifically for it. Um, Julie says the owl is my favorite. Yeah, I want to see. You, Julie. I want to see him a little bit bigger. So this is how to put the finishing <laughs> touches on it, and it's really cute. Your almost autumn placemat is finished. Okay, now we get a closer look. You know what? Beautiful. That owl is awesome. I even like the darker colors in it. Mm -hmm. um, but applique. So that's applique, applique. What do you think of the pumpkin? I love the pumpkin as well. <clears throat> this is magnificent. Okay, so I'm pretty happy. Autumn is calling. Oh my God, look at this. The rose. Out of leaves. Oh, they're so clever. Uh oh. What is Julie saying? Uh oh. <laughs> Because uh -oh. they're awesome. Oh, give thanks. That is probably the cutest Thanksgiving I've seen. Gather. I like it. Just beautiful. I like it. Really nice. Thankful. Can you imagine that in the front hall when you come in? Mm -hmm. Thankful. That's a nice uh, wreath with the leaves. Yep. I like them. Julie says, yep, awesome. Oh, cinnamon spice and everything nice. You know what? This is completely original. I can't say I've seen a coffee cup made out of autumn leaves. Nope. I love it. Home sweet home. Wow, you could make some really nice frame designs out of these. Love it. Oh. Oh, wow. The whole tree. That's oh, awesome. That is gorgeous. Welcome fall. I, I love fall most of all. You like the tree? I like the tree. He's amazing. Oh, little ones to go with it. The lettering to go with it. So you can put it together and make your own. Um, that They would be beautiful on a pennant garland. Yeah, they would be. Mm -hmm. I like 
I like all the like the original lettering. Ooh, sneak peek. Apples. Yum. Delightful drawstring. Well, I like this witchy. Spooky blanket stitch. Ah, I love yes. blanket stitch applique. So chrysalis applique, fluttering and fabulous. Fabulous. <laughs> Julie says, goodness, this whole set too. I know. I know. So wow, nice bright colors. That is fabric that was created by Stephen Wilson, who is the founder of Anita Good Design. I have I've never been able to find it, but it's beautiful. Like uh, beautiful. I'll get you some one day. I'll find it. You can't find it. It's not possible. But it's beautiful. Design size. We're gonna go all the way from ten uh, something and by sixteen, which is a heck of a hoop. I used my That's biggest. Big. Yeah. <laughs> That was scary on McDreamy. Dodd had to take off the big hoop. I'm like, hey, this the it's a big hoop. He's like, yeah, yeah, I know. And then he started pulling it out. He's like, oh, so, yeah, it's a bit awkward. It's a big hoop. Oh, so beautiful. Very nice. They do a fantastic job with the butterflies. Yeah. Oh, I love it when we can see it closer. Okay, so I wonder if these were designed to use with just his fabrics, but I I think you could do just about anything. Mm -hmm. I mean, chrysalis fabric is nice if I could get my hands on it. Beautiful. Wow. Oh, wow. Isn't that nice? Better get your duck bills sharpened up. <laughs> yes. <laughs> True story. <laughs> Because there's going to be a lot of applique. I love applique. I think it's the most fun you can have. Uh, and it's so creative. Yeah, that's fabric. I just so, like looking at the detail work in their stitching. It's beautiful. Yeah. I love like this orange flower here. I love it. Amazing. Oh, black and white. Oh, that's different. It looks good, though. You could really fussy cut with these, especially if you do it big enough. Wish they would send you some. Yeah, I know. I know. Beautiful. Beautiful. So much. Oh, look at this. I love the delicate. A or it, it would. Mm -hmm. It would. Even a t-shirt. I'm, I'm thinking kind of jeans. Yeah, well, yeah. This would be great designs on jeans. Sexy robot, you're back. Ugh. It says excellent condition up there, so... Yeah, but everything is good. It's got to be... got to be you two. We were good this morning on the same settings. I think I saw a small size duck bills at the quilt shop here. I may have to put it on my Christmas list. I'm going to give that yes. <laughs> I know, I know. These butterflies are awesome. And just picture with different colors... Um, they're beautiful with this fabric, though. Look at that one. I'm thinking on jeans. I don't know why. Oh, so beautiful. Look at all the detail. I just love it all. That's amazing. Okay, so more butterflies. Now, I really like intricate stuff all the time. You know, I think it's pretty cool. But I also like simple. Now, this fabric is um, stunning. And these are all bean stitches. So, yes, it is. Sorry about the sound. It is YouTube. And we can't control it. It's kind of annoying. So, hopefully you guys can hear, still hear me well enough. I'm going to have a little drink, though. No, Karina. I don't need any butterflies on my jeans. Jeez. The sound usually clears up in a minute. Yeah, it's a uh, YouTube not managing their bandwidth properly or it's a heavy usage time. I don't know. But anyways, these are all continuous designs, it looks like, in bean stitches. So um, if you 
you had a nice contrasting fabric and thread, I think it would be stunning. They're beautiful designs, it's like black and white. Right. Oh, and simple too. And look at this here, and then look at it around. Fluttering free motion. I think that's beautiful. And you know what? I think that would be a fantastic um, gift because you could whip that up a lot quicker than, you know, the farm I ones. actually like the wood frame that they're using to mount on the wall. That's kind of a good idea, isn't yeah. it? We should look into that a little bit more, I think. Oh, see darker around the edge? That is That's nice. Good. Yeah, I really like it. Look how well that uh, stitching comes into the corner. Then, of course, we learned how to do it. So, batting, backing, square up your batting, and then stitch everything out. That'll stitch very quickly, and it's beautiful. Look at this. Oh, you know, you could do some of the other butterfly designs in blocks and use the same size of these, like, for opposite blocks. I like it. I, this one stands out. This one here. It, it's just cool how it's done. Oh, this one. Oh, this one. Okay, I like them. <laughs> just saying. Kind of like all of them. Kind of, yeah, this is the block that I saw, I think. Yeah, it's really neat. Um, next time AG has a discount. Is that kind of like a motif stitch? Uh, kind of, but a little more complicated than that because it's um, a quilting stitch. So maybe like a big motif stitch, but it has to be, you would freehand digitize this, right? Oh, yeah. 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 So, yes and no. So pretty. I wish they used, like, bright white or something. It's easier to see. I think that's cool. There, now we can see it better. And these are all the pieces that you need to finish it. The sashing and the outside. Kind of looks it's like all... Trapunto. No, they said it's uh, all bean stitch, which is lovely. Oh, this is what... I was just talking about the magic of merging. Isn't that stunning? So these are the butterflies from the collection beforehand. Oh, thank you, Gail. That's awesome. And look, merge it together. The stashing looks stunning. <laughs> and the outside. I think this outside is gorgeous. It's beautiful. But one, two, three four of the fancy ones and then just the blue that's amazing so the magic of merging i'm going to read a little bit about that um i think that's a great way of doing it oh look at here with different size quilt oh, blocks that's different that is really nice so in the middle they're doing two bigger ones with more detail and then matching them up with the end ones see this is another thing that i really like as well is they show how to merge two designs oh, on, the, on, the uh, on the machine so nice. bring in the outside bring in the inside and then how to do it and i really like that because that is super helpful for everyone and the things you have to remember to trim and do the folded fabric no fabric chicken on that <laughs> and uh then do your applique awesome back it up that's awesome oh, nice. karina thank you thank you very much for showing us this namaste stitching out your design so it's applique and i think that's really cute on um a tank top like that they're they're pretty actually mm -hmm. it'd be great for anyone who does yoga like this oh this is cute oh they all have flowers, the flowers around, around them oh and the flowers are so beautiful all right i like that one oh then sayings to go with it too very nice breathe balance take care of yourself yeah, you could um, match them up quite nicely with the drawings. Sneak peek of Virginia's bouquet. 
Oh, a tile scene. Oh, 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 oh. What do you think of that? I think it's awesome. <laughs> You're a little speechless there? I'm, I'm reading. <laughs> oh, Don can't do two things at once. Book lovers. Well, I have That's a couple awesome. of those. I like that by Lindsay Griffin. Awesome. Oh, that's so cute. Well, I like the colors in it mm -hmm. and the style. Kind of a sketchy drawing. Oh, yeah, I like that one especially. Just shades of one color. That's really nice. Mm -hmm. I could see this like on a back of a or the front of a shirt. Yeah, these are really well done. Oh, nice. Yeah. Look at this one on a bookshelf. Of course, with a butterfly. <laughs> Ooh, I have lots of book lover friends. Well, these are amazing. Underwater stories, flowers with a nice worn book. That's cute. Bookworm accessories. Well Let's see. Smart stuff. <laughs> I love sitting and reading this. I'll be this is what I'll be doing tonight. Measuring a book. Okay. This is something I have been wondering about to, to make a book cover because I think that is a gorgeous idea. Um, but I wasn't sure how to measure it and how to do it. So I'm thinking we're going to find out. Oh, isn't that pretty? Oh, it looks pretty easy. Yeah. Get the right size. Measure your book. Oh. Okay, well, look, these measurements here are the same as here. Hmm. And then you got to leave this space plus a little. Oh, learn something new every day, huh? Perfect pairings. All right, now I like the little bookmark tag. Oh my God, is that cute? Tea bag bookmarks coming soon. In a future all-access release. I like that. That is the cutest thing I have ever seen. And original again. Mm -hmm. AG designs are far superior to many of the other digitized designs out there. That's why I love it. That is exactly why I love it. They're all professional and they're done properly. Cutesy and I love cozies. it. I think that donut is adorable. Coffee with wings. Coffee gives you wings. 40% off on the AG site for the weekend. Use checklist. I'm not sure if it applies to these designs, but it might. Okay, that would be a tough call between the donut and the pizza dude. <laughs> I like the pizza dude. Pizza dude's awesome. I love it. Look at the fabric. Woo! The okay. coffee with wings is cool. This looks really cool with the turquoise, turquoise thread, mm. and then a really busy print. Yeah, these guys are really cute. Oh, there's um, more. Mustache. Fantastic. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> Coffee and wings. And a crafty fox eating cupcakes. And, of course, sunshine. That will probably be mine. I don't drink coffee, but, you know. Oh, Llama for B. Um, she's also the drama queen. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> Come on, tell me I'm wrong. No. They're fab as we can't buy bl blank cozies in the UK. I wouldn't buy blank ones anyways. Uh, are you going to do a cozy live stream? Yeah, that is a strong a possibility because I want one. And if I'm going to make it, I might as well make it with you guys, um, which is awesome. <laughs> Pizza so dude rocks. <laughs> pizza dude rocks. He needs hair though right here. He doesn't have any hair. How you back it? Yeah, okay. We can follow these step-by-step -step instructions. See, now he has hair. The top crust. Yep, I like it. So, two elastics and two buttons is mm -hmm. how you put it together. Okay, 4x4 four four hoop. For a 4x4 four four hoop. Wow. That's nice. I'm still stuck on pizza guys staring at me. But the dragonflies. I know. They're beautiful. All right. And the 4x4 four four hoop. 
and this is what you end up with. Isn't that beautiful? Look at the colors. Makes me think of the Dance of the Dragonfly <laughs> fabric. Because you could use the fabric here and design it here. Mm -hmm. I like it. So merging, a little merging lesson. Look at the detail in this. So what I like about these designs is the amount of detail in a 4x4 is absolutely incredible. But a filled in dragonfly and then an outlined flower. I think that looks amazing. It draws it's your really eye. Neat. Like it makes a dragonfly um, stand out. Okay, yeah. so these guys are cool. This one is beautiful. This one too. This one. Yep. Yeah. Chalkboard family sayings. Go ask your mother. Official rule maker. Me. And nobody asked me. I have adult children. So on a black t-shirt, a little bit of applique. Easy peasy. I love chalkboard style anything. Mm -hmm. Go ask your mother. Go ask your father. Wow. Beautiful lettering. Very nice. Official rule breaker. Official <laughs> rule maker. Beatrice and I can wear that. That's awesome. Don't mess with my sister. That's my job. Mm, fair enough. Fair enough. I love how they put the lettering together. That's fantastic. My favorite people call me uncle. Aww. Auntie is my name. Spoiling is my game. <laughs> Awesome. It's pretty good. Dads know a lot, but grandpas know everything. Yep. Grandma life is the best life. Yep. <laughs> How to get what you want. Make a bag or a t-shirt out of that. I, I love it. Chalkboard look is fantastic and easy to do. Mm -hmm. The basic steps. Merging your block. What are we merging? Did I click over click? Oh, no. To make this? Oh, that would be cool. Yeah, it is. Merge, 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 and then do. Love it. Oh, that's awesome. And then, look, it shows you how Piece to put it together. it together. Make a bag. Okay, that Very is nice. really groovy. I love how they did the straps like that. That's a lot easier than I've seen. Okay, well, that's not dramatically hard, is no, it? No, it looks pretty easy. Yep. Everything you need to know about making a bag. That is not difficult at all. Amazing. I didn't realize they were going to... Oh, and the lining, too. All right. Well, how much fun is that? That's not hard at all. I like this little purse bag. Yeah. But I really like this. I'll carry on. That's nice. I would love one that says single uncle seeking aunt. My brother needs that. <laughs> awesome. All new releases on the way. All right. So this is another one of my favorite things. Word clouds. Quilts on a clothesline. Look at that. Oh, that's a neat thing. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to look forward to these bookmarks. The bookmarks. Yeah. yeah, for sure. Cuckoo clock danglers. Oh, oh. All right, I'm going to like all of those. Not sure about the cuckoo clock, but they might be interesting. Um, Seasonal word clouds? Yes. I, I love the word clouds. That just, I don't know, makes me happy. Um, and this is really nice. Quilts on a clothesline. Um, Sue, do you have the dime word clouds? Yes, I do. Don't you remember my chocolate bunny with a whole <laughs> bunch of words? Yeah, it's awesome. And um, it stitches out beautifully. I could play with it all day. So generally, I don't open it because I could play all day. This guy is cute. So is that pocket notebook covers oh notebook cover with a pocket i get it that's beautiful mm -hmm. oh there's gonna be more to make look at the flowers i like the little bunny now girl I'll buy more notebooks to put them on I, i've got a lot 
I'd use it more if it had this. <laughs> nice anatomy of the design and how you put it together. Okay. Oh, that got a flash there. Stitching your pocket. Okay, this isn't hard. And then going to the notebook measurements again. Sarah says it would be great on jeans, too. Yeah. I know, it's so adorable. Nice lines, lining it up. I would love a jean notebook cover. Well, that's really cool. And then assembling. Th I got lots to learn this month, <laughs> I'm telling you. Be reading this for a bit. Y yeah, I'm going to be going through it because I think notebook covers with this nice. really cute design. Judy says, where's the best place to purchase the all-access issue? Um, online, I think you can purchase it. Um, they usually only send the books out to dealers if you order it, but it's such a great savings. Most people just sign up for the year and uh, totally enjoy it. There's so much in this one. If you do it all online, it's just there. Yeah, you, you'll get it immediately, which I really um, appreciate it, which is awesome. Because I, I know on the first I'll have my all access. It becomes pretty important. Didn't know if you would get credit. You uh, can, you can just put Sue on it if there's a order thing. That's there's what, a spot for comments or something. Yeah. Yeah. Then, yes, that kind of cred would be cool. Oh, look at the artist. Oh, Cindy King, this one's for you. <laughs> Look at that, some leftover jelly beans, too. I know, some fell on the floor. That is really <laughs> cute. That is cute. Oh, and makeup, look at those lips are <clears throat> perfect. And butterflies. I like it. Uh, I think this guy is so cute with his hands over. I love that. There you go. Maybe we'll make one just for you, Cindy. Okay, school stuff. These are super cute. All right, so poop bags. We've gone from pretty pockets to the, poop bags. They're they're pet bags. Well, <laughs> I know. <laughs> they're awful cute, though. They are. I love this common mistake. Thumbs down. Don't make it. So all the things you need. Not a whole lot of fabric, and they tie closed. So everything you need... Uh, five by seven hoop frame for larger. So that's, awesome. That's for when you have the big dogs. <laughs> we do now. And you need the big bags. <laughs> I dig you. <laughs> I love that one. That's cute. Okay, that's funny, isn't it? Look at the little decorations around it. Raise the woof. That's the cute. woof. Yeah. Did someone say I'm not saying that word out loud? I rough you very much. Yeah, wow, these are cute. You, you don't necessarily have to make a poop bag out of it because I think oh, these are... or whatever in it. I, I think it's really cute. Look at this, wag more, bark less. And it's all tails wagging. Okay. <laughs> okay, I like that one. You like the butt? <laughs> I like that one. Would you like to pull Rule a bag? number one, pick up number two. Yeah, well... That's pretty good. I think that's really... <laughs> wow. I really like, <laughs> I like that. that I'm here awesome. for the tail wags poo bags. All right. That's awesome. Dog hair don't care. Okay, that could be on a shirt. That yeah. can be on a shirt because... Oh, my God, the dog father. <laughs> Very well done, Anita. Good That's design. Good. I I really like that. So this is how you make it. But like I said, you don't have to use them to make bags because they're adorable. I think it's adorable like that. I agree. <laughs> it almost makes me want to buy a dog. <laughs> well, we have three, so but we like all of ours. They're wonderful. 
Okay, that's easy. Put the drawstring in, lift it over. I'm Very I'm awesome. gonna be yeah. They learning. would be great on bandanas too. Oh yeah, great idea. Yeah, with the funny sayings, I, I'm pretty sure people will get a chuckle out of it. Okay, so this is a very interesting way of making a drawstring. You don't have to feed everything through because it's already through. Time saver. Mistake saver. Applique. Oh, look at the poo splat. Gross. I dig you. <laughs> it's applique poo. <laughs> Freed a new low. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> awesome yeah and then you cut it cut it out i think it's a great idea i think these are awesome looking. they really are so you end up with this I, I again i really like it going through so you don't have to um fight with it it's a mud mud splat because it's oh. dig oh my bad See, my mind was in the gutter. <laughs> it was in the poop bag, apparently. <laughs> apparently, sorry. Oh, look, and then just a little bit of sewing. I could do this sewing. Um, put it together. Turn it. Oh, yeah, you corner. do the corners. Turn it. That's awesome. That's awesome. Well. Wow. Simple oh, little project. Look at that. That is, that's the I like the it done on the burlap. That's yeah. That's, That's what nice. everyone was asking about. We can do this, Sue. Yes, I think we should. Um, so much learning in this one. This uh, got my attention. I think that's great. Look at all. I'm just going to quickly flip, flip through. Look at all the embroidery designs that you get in this issue. There's so many. I can't even keep up with it. There's hundreds of designs. I'm loving this butterfly stuff. Mm -hmm. Look at all that. Pizza man! Pizza dude. Donut. Cinnabon. Ooh, I might have to go. Pockets. Poop bags. So, wow. It's a heck of an issue. Uh, it's an amazing uh, issue. Uh, yeah, it really is. So, I like the big quilt. I like the butterfly quilt matched with the butterflies almost autumn was stunning pocket notebook covers is really cute and there's lots to learn in that one mm -hmm. um poop bags and cozies. cozies and i can't wait for the tea bag bookmarks yeah what's my favorite uh, i'm gonna say this quilt just blows me down Special ed edition Olanita had a farm. So many cute designs and the I plaid. Like the almost and... autumn is my favorite. Yeah, it's a tough call on this one, but the the designs for the um, poop bags. But then there's Mr. Pizza. Eh. Pizza dude is cool. There's lots in this one <laughs> that I see. Like, when I look at the farm thing, I think of, like, blue fabric or mm -hmm. something like that that would be nice. Um, barn, yes, let's not forget about that barn that I'm going to do. Um, awesome. I think this is really an awesome addition. So, August rocks. Kind of does. I thought Christmas in July rocked, but... August rocks. There's so much to do. And yes, let's do some lives. We can uh, carry on the conversation in the OML Embroidery University Facebook group. And uh, we'll throw in an extra class or two live stitching. And we will come up with some fun things. Maybe a farm square. I think we're going to have to do Mr. Pizza because he's just yep, awesome. Yeah, Mr. Pizza, dude. Yeah, and maybe um, figure out together how to do a book cover because I think that's fantastic. That so, oh, that, stop. She, <laughs> dragonflies. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Poo bag and pizza. Um, yeah, this is awesome. I really oh, like this. Ones. Oh, it's just all great. <laughs> I have a lot to learn um, about 
a lot of things in here and i really like that i'm up for the challenge mm -hmm. i'm up for the challenge some so more, some more learning yeah thanks everyone for watching i hope you guys like this video i hope you guys love these embroidery designs as much as i do and uh i'll see you guys tomorrow for the most amazing stitch along for anita good design we just love this stuff so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Eat your candy, Cindy. Candy King. <laughs> Bye. Bye.